I'm Jerry Yang. I'm the co-founder and chief Yahoo. Yahoo is a uh, place on the internet where um, you can find all kinds of information. You can do your email. You can look for content. And really, you know, we're one of the largest websites in the world. We're a premier digital media company where we offer over 680 million users every month just whatever they need on the internet. When I was at Stanford, I was an undergraduate and I studied electrical engineering. And I went on and got my master's degree in electrical engineering as well. Um, and I was in the process of doing my PhD, uh, almost, uh, almost finished, I like to think, uh, three or four years in. Um, and then this little Yahoo thing got in the way. When we were starting to think about our hobby as a potential business enterprise, how encouraging, how helpful, how everybody wanted to help rather than what could have easily been hey, you guys are not supposed to be doing this, you're supposed to be doing that. So um, this very welcoming and sort of this collaborative, um, almost sort of excited for you effort that exists at Stanford even back in 1994 was, um, you know, obviously that was a key element to why Yahoo got launched. There is a lot of cross-pollination between academics, inner industry, and entrepreneurship and innovation. That was just part of, you know, you, it's hard to go through Stanford without being exposed to it. Stanford is extremely important to me because it allowed me to um, not only create Yahoo, to find the right network of people, to find the right education, to find the right skills. Um, to this day, I link back to those experiences and um, I think it really is a foundation of you know, who I am and what I've done. Stanford has such powerful traits and attributes that can fit perfectly in the New York context. Uh, but at the end of the day, I believe that Stanford has to be able to bring the Stanford experience. Great education, great academics, great research, um, being able to really take the best students and turn them into leaders of our next generation, multidisciplinary. These are the core ingredients of success of Stanford. I wouldn't go so far as saying that necessarily you bring Silicon Valley there. You know, it may take a totally different form because when you have the best people, the best professors, the best research done in that location, magic happens. And um, so we may see something that we completely did not anticipate today, but I think that's the beauty of Stanford. <laughs>